What is up everyone, my name is Exceptional and today I'm going to give you all the information to defeat the third boss, Bone Mass. Bone Mass is one of the hardest bosses in the whole game. Due to the swamp and all its poison damage, it can be a real struggle. But I will tell you what to do in preparation and what the best strategy is to beat him. But before we go into the video, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing for more Valheim videos. Let's get into it. The number one most important thing you need to do is prepare. There are at least two things you need to grind for. One is poison resistant potions and the other is a blunt melee weapon. Let's start with the poison resistance. Poison resistance is key in the bone mass fight. You could do it without it, but prepare to die a lot. This potion does a couple of things for you. It halves the poison duration and halves the damage per second while poisoned. Whenever you drink one, you are protected for 8 minutes in total. So if you are doing this, I would recommend at least 3 of these. The more, the better. A very important aspect is that if you die, the resistance is negated. So you will need to drink another one. So how do you get these poison resistance potions? The first thing you need is a cauldron. A cauldron can be unlocked whenever you discover tin. You need 10 tin to build a cauldron. Put a campfire underneath it and it is up and running. Interact with the cauldron and go to the meat base poison resistance. To cook this, you will need 10 honey, 5 thistle, 1 nectil and 10 coal. It is pretty easy to find, except for the honey. You can find honey in abandoned houses whenever there are beehives there. Whenever you destroy it, it will drop some honey and a queen bee. You will need some queen bees to make your own beehives, so you can keep making your own honey. Whenever you have everything you need, cook the poison resistance meat. Whenever that is done, you need one more thing, a fermenter. The fermenter will turn the meat into potions. You need 20 fine wood, 5 bronze and 10 raisin to make a fermenter. Whenever you have it, put the meat in and wait a while. And there you go, you are almost ready to fight bone mass. Now let's get into the weapon part. The weapon type that is most effective against bone mass are blunt weapons. Think about maces, hammers and the stag breaker. The best weapon for you at this moment is the iron mace. Go grind for it, farm a lot of iron and make the mace. So now that you have everything, it is time to go for bone mass. Don't forget to bring 10 withered bones for the sacrifice ritual. A quick little tip. Make a base close enough to bone mass with a bed, so if you die, you spawn close enough. So how do you defeat bone mass? He has three different attacks. One is his close range swipe attack. This is a slow attack and very easy to dodge roll. Dodge roll and hit him a few times with your mace. With the second attack, he throws a green ball that turns into monsters. The monsters are blobs and skeletons. Make sure you kill these as soon as possible. Remember, blobs poison you, so that is where the potions come in. And his last attack, and his most annoying one, is the puke attack. Yes, he pukes. He starts to grab his stomach for a few seconds and he will puke acid all around him. Whenever he does that, you get away from him and focus on the monsters for a few seconds until the acid disappears. So what is the best way to fight him? Get close to him, dodge his swipe attacks, keep smacking him with your mace and wait till he pukes. When he pukes, run away because it will poison you. Whenever he is puking, just kill the monsters around you. Rinse and repeat this process. His swipe is very predictable and easy to dodge. If you keep doing this and avoid the swipe and puke, you will get him down eventually. He has a lot of health, but just keep doing the same thing. Don't even try shooting arrows, it doesn't do anything at all. Good luck and I will see you in the next video.